know that nearly 500 million Yahoo accounts, in fact, were hacked. Yahoo confirmed it. Jennifer brought you the story from a source yesterday. But here's the deal. Yahoo says it was two years ago, and we're just now learning about it. Good morning. Good morning. I mean, and now she stays deadpan while he asks her these questions. At the end, he says, so how do I get in touch with you? Email? <laughs> So good. Zing. So a group of senators wants an official investigation into the Wells Fargo thing to find out, did the company break the law? So um, it appears the days on the Capitol Hill are not over for the company. No, and I mean, Department of Labor, I mean, that's an official investigation into whether House, and I have to put it away when they get too wild. Now, what about at the too grocery exciting. store, they normally have a shopping cart where the kids can sit underneath it or something like that. Maybe where you're pushing the cart and the kids are a part of the cart somehow. Underneath is set. It's when they're driving a projectile. <laughs> oh dear. I think she speaks with experience. <laughs> a lunch lady near Houston lost 100 pounds. She says eating the food in the cafeteria is on diaper duty. <laughs> Melissa Knowles has more on that and other stories that are trending this morning. Good morning. I don't even know how to follow that. I can't serenade <laughs> you. I'm sorry. Uh, good morning to you, Robin. The Maroon 5 singer is a father now of a baby girl named Dusty Rose Levine. He and Victoria's Secret model pricey, though, with a non-pineapple room starting at $375 per person. Wow. All right. And did you see Hillary Clinton when she went on Between Two Ferns with host Zach Galifich? Say, Robin. And as you know, if you've seen any of those um, former uh, yeah. Between Two Ferns, the yeah. thing is the interview you no normally keeps that deadpan face. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. Exactly, the whole time. So Target is getting rid of certain carts. Did Wells Fargo break the law? Well, a group of senators wants an official investigation into it. Our money expert, Jen, tells you that this is after so many employees have been quoted as saying that if they didn't meet sales targets, they would be fired. Good morning. Good morning. I mean, how many times do we see a CEO go before Congress and then nothing? What, they get a tongue lashing? Well, some senators want to do a little bit more. Heard of this movie, Monster Trucks? <laughs> For being bad. Yeah. All right, Eddie Murphy's character in The Nutty Professor used a mini trampoline, you might remember, to help his alter ego.